Well, ladies and gentlemen, they say it can't be done. Why can't you change your thinking? Everybody else does. But we here at Eddie Wright Barbecue do not believe in the can't. We like to give it the old barbecue try. And today, we're making tater tot casserole. So the thought behind this is simply this. Tater tot casserole, but smoked. We're gonna do everything on the GMG Jumbo with Prime. First and foremost, this idea is not original. We got it from our guy Clay. Shouts out to him and his wife for putting it together on their Facebook page. Make sure you follow them. I'll leave a link in the description. So we saw it and we said, hmm, I wonder if it's possible to pull this entire thing off, put our own spin to it, but smoke the entire thing. So that's what we're gonna do today. We've got a skillet on the grill right now. We sprayed it with a little nonstick spray. We're gonna take some ground turkey. Instead of beef this time, we're gonna use some cream mushroom and chicken. Taste of chicken broth, a little cream cheese, tater tots, and two types of Velveeta cheese shreds, mozzarella, and original. And we are gonna make the most epic smoked tater tot casserole that you've ever seen on the web. So, let's get to it. I'm a fighter. That's the way I made it, that's what you married. All right, well, I'm back to Stormtrooper. GMG's fired up. Right now we're rolling at 215. We've got some ambient heat. Temperature says about 250. We've got our skillet here. We're gonna go ahead and get our turkey on. We're gonna use a little picking and grilling banjo dust to get our seasoning profile going. We'll get it nice, seasoned up, browned up, drain it, and then we'll add everything else. All right, guys, this is labor of love. We got the turkey in, we got the banjo dust on, and as you can see, it's a low and slow process. Take your time, it's an all day type of thing. Well, at least three or four hours. So you don't have to rush it. Get it in, let it roll, roll smoke. At about 200, we're gonna close it down, get up about 250. We got a guy get down draft, choked out a little bit. We'll see if we can get as much smoke into this as we can. Let's go. All right, guys, hope you can hear me. Got our turkey browned up, strained and drained. Got our pot back in. Got our ingredients over here. Our Trinity, we're gonna throw it in, get a nice little simmer going, get a nice little roux together. Then we're gonna combine the turkey meat back with the base. Then we're gonna get it all mixed up and get ready to pan it. So, let's go. peek in on our mix it's looking good roaring down here on the end temperature gauge tamping at about 250 which is cool gonna we'll stir it up a little Ooh, gonna we'll stir it up a little bit sorry about that while that's getting done sorry for my camera kind of trying to avoid as much smoke as i can add a little banjo dust to here for flavor so now we have our pan now we're gonna start our layers. We're gonna start, we're gonna spray it with a little nonstick spray. We're gonna put a layer of tots down. We're gonna get those good and warm. We don't wanna put the mix over cold tots. So let's get that done. All right, we've got our bottom layer of tots here. We're gonna get them on. Get some smoke on them, get the party going. Then we'll come back, we'll put our turkey in here, get it bubbling up a little bit more, then we'll add, we'll top it with some cheese, top it with some tots, and let it go. We'll be back. It's time to combine. We've got our mozzarella, we've got our turkey meat. Go ahead and open. We're gonna move our mix over to the side so these tots can get a little bit more of the direct heat. Cruising at about 270 right now. And uh, yeah, once we combine, 
you'll see the magic and then we'll get ready to top them and finish them up let's go now i know what you're saying smoke flavor what do you use well today we're doing it over the jack daniels combination that doesn't even exist this is jack pecan you got your jack on top below you got your pecan pellets as the gym boys sifts them down through the hopper they all kind of combine and mix as it goes so hey this is our smoke combination for today's meal and we hope you guys enjoy All right, we've got our turkey mixed back in with our liquid mix, our wet mix. Gonna slide it down here, lower the temp a little bit. Gonna slide our tots down. Gonna top them off with a little cheese, get that melted on. Then we'll marry them together. This is one layer, this is two layer, another layer of tots, another layer of cheese. We're gonna smoke it till it's ready. Moments later. One is in the bag, we're about to top it off with tots. And we'll be right back with more. A few moments later. We've got everything combined. We got our top layer of tots on. I want you guys to take a look at it, see what's popping. Got a little bubbly, gooey, gushes going on right there. Gonna let the tots start to get browned up a little bit. Then we're gonna top with a little cheese, let that melt down. And then we're gonna let it cool. Stay tuned. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm very happy to say this is a complete product. Uh, smoked tater tot casserole made with turkey. We smoked the turkey in the interior of the GMG Jimboy Prime from start to finish. From tater tots to the smoked turkey, sorry, to the ground turkey that we made in a pan on the smoker. Kept it low and slow for the majority of the time. Finished it at about 285 for about 30 minutes. I'm gonna cut into this. I'm gonna taste it. We're gonna talk about the results, guys. Let's go. Live from the plate, guys. This is our finished product, smoked tater tot casserole. We did it in a little different form. Everything was done on the GMG Jimboy Prime. Bottom layer, tots and mozzarella. Middle layer, our wet mix mixed with our uh, ground turkey. Browned with a little banjo dust from Picking and Grilling Barbecue. Top layer, tots with uh, Velveeta shreds. Regular cheddar on top and a little dab of sour cream to match on top guys i hope you guys enjoyed this up guys i hope you enjoyed this episode as i have enjoyed cooking this um let's talk about the taste real quick and yes i am eating with a spoon so please save your complaints Love the way this looks. Still hot. Let's taste it out. Honestly, I was unsure you'd be able to get the smoke to penetrate. That's why I did it in phases. Um, and I think doing it that way, you get the essence of the smoke and the flavor most definitely breathe it in the taste is there nice salt content turkey is amazing get a piece with the sour cream top layer got a little sour cream on here ladies and gentlemen that is heaven I encourage you to try this yourself. I'll put the recipe in the description. Put your own little spin on it. Shout out to my guy Clay for giving me the motivation. Again, guys, smoked potato tot casserole. We're gonna call this a win. Thank you guys for checking out the channel. Make sure you like and subscribe to everything that we have going on. Stay quarantined, stay safe, flatten the curve, and always remember, you too can do amazing barbecue the right way. See you next time.